Megan Olivia here at the MGM Grand in Las Vegas. I'm with Roy Nelson, who fights Frank Mir this Saturday at UFC 130. Roy, first of all, I've got to say your hair's looking great. What have you done differently? I got a haircut yesterday, so now it's really it's good now. It's luscious. All right, now you, are, you live in Las Vegas. How much easier does that make fight week activities and events, like the press conference for you? Uh, press conference makes it hard because they got to drive all the way in here. The, like the PR stuff, it's easier to actually be in the hotel, but... Um, but I like sleeping at home. I like I like my own computer. I don't have to worry about laptop. I don't have to worry about internet connection or anything stupid like that. Um, uh, plus, uh, I know every all my normal surroundings. Uh, plus, Vegas is open 24-7. Very true. You brought in Dan Hardy to help you train for this fight. How much has Dan brought to you that you know you feel fully prepared now for Frank? Uh, Dan's brought a lot. He made me move his uh, wash, washer and dryer. Um, he, you know, he's just, he's trying to make me a home man. Get me all, you know, ready for just moving him in. So he just moved here last Friday, so. Very nice. Do you think if you beat Frank on Saturday, you deserve the title shot? Um, I think uh, Pete and Frank, um, you know, says something when you, you know, beat a two-time UFC champion. Um, I think it definitely puts you somewhere right towards the top. Uh, it's just so hard with the UFC landscape with the with everybody already being occupied with Shane fighting Dos Santos, Brock pulling out. Like, I mean, if Brock wants to come back, I'll be the first one to fight him. I'm, I'm cool with that. Very nice. Now let's talk about that um, Shane and Dos Santos fight. Who do you think is going to come out on top in that one? Uh, I like to say uh, Dos Santos is. Uh, I've never fought Shane, so I couldn't really tell you, but Dos Santos beat me, so I'm going to go with Dos Santos. Would you like a rematch if you could? Uh, yeah, I, I could see me fighting Dos Santos um, uh, when he becomes UFC champion. All right, and finally, I've got to ask you, how many items from Burger King do you think you're going to eat after Saturday's fight? Probably zero. Really? N not, the, not the answer I was expecting. I was trying, Burger King, I was trying to look for the big sponsor, and, you know, they they don't want to be a sponsor, so I'm not supporting them either. <laughs> All right, I like that way of thinking. Thank you so much, Roy. Good luck on Saturday. Thank you. For more UFC 130 information, keep checking heavy.com and watch Fight Day this Saturday.